Princess Jezebel ain't got nothing to do with no makeup and no lipstick and no short dress. Can I help you tonight? Jezebel is a spirit of control. It's a spirit of manipulation. It's a spirit of witchcraft. And a man can have a Jezebel spirit. Touch your name and tell them you got to learn how to praise. Well, I made some demons mad already. I need somebody to bahasha. Come on and get the head shit. Give God some praise because Jezebel has to die. That's a controlling spirit that has their own group and their own crew. And when they move, they crew move. And when they don't come to church, they crew don't come to church. And when they don't support, their crew don't support. But we come against that Jezebel spirit in the name of Jesus. Jezebel loses her power tonight. Now you got to be watchful because I've dealt with many Jezebels because I am a prophet. And the spirit of Jezebel is always attracted to the prophet because they come to squeeze life out of the prophetic ministry. Jezebel's assignment is to hinder the preaching of the word of God. Jezebel's assignment is to tie up the gifts of the spirit. Most of us are deceived by Jezebel's spirit because let me tell you how Jezebel gets you because she didn't got me a couple of times. Come on, Bishop. Come on, help us. Jezebel is faithful. Jezebel comes to Bible class. Jezebel comes to Sunday school. Jezebel is a tither. Jezebel follows you to preach. Because most pastors are blinded by faithfulness. Because there's one thing all of us want is loyalty and faithfulness so sometimes you can't even see Jezebel because she's always there 